Every season is stronger, yeah. Depth squad and add more and more players and top top quality, yeah. Every season is is even better and even better. Always I have a highly opinion about him, his team. Everybody knows that he grew up as a team year by year. So there's no doubt about that. And both years have been close, but we have been so strong as well. And uh, still we are strong and uh, looking forward for the game. We want to be at the level that we want to be. We have to be really good on the road and at home. <laughs> There's not a choice. Uh, so we have to continue to to be that consistent, get the results, especially get the performances that are going to get us the results. I think this team has always reacted that way. And, uh, and the fact that uh, obviously we weren't satisfied and we wanted more and we knew that, uh, that we could be there and we have the level and, and we lost a few things on the way that didn't allow us to be there. Um, that has to be in the tummy, you know, and a new season, a uh, new opportunity, and that's a beautiful thing about sports. They started off quite well uh, with a win uh, against our neighbours uh, that uh, caught the eye the most, of course, because they were 2 0 down uh, so late in the game. Ireola has done a, a, a tremendous job over there, plays uh, a nice football to watch, uh, develops players, uh, has a nice playing style, so um, all credits for him, but hopefully we, uh, we can manage to. Um, to do better against Bournemouth tomorrow than we did against Nottingham Forest last week. It's always tough there, it's always aggressive there. But we know also the circumstances and you can't compare this. And we had, we didn't have a, a fit squad. We had even one, two players, they were maybe up to 20% to play, but we had to play them. And this time is totally different. We have now a fit squad of, we have definitely uh, 18 players who are capable had to go into uh, this this good challenge for us. So last week against City, I thought they played really well. Um, uh, took the game to City, and um, it's always a challenge. But that's that's the Premier League. I don't think there's any games you go into thinking they're, they're going to be any uh, easier than any others. And uh, uh, yeah, we have to be ready for, for Brentford tomorrow. And uh, but we are at home, and you know we, we just got like I said, we've got to make sure we continue with our strong performances in the league, but turn those performances into results. I think this is a good squad, but uh, I also said that if the last two years we finish 12 and we finish 6, to improve is not something automatic. So I think the squad is good, but uh, the, 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 only, the only way to reach some important target, like uh, top four, just to try to be focused on game after game. Otherwise, if you think about April, May, it's too, it's too far. Every part of the Premier League season is critical. You know, you've got to... You don't design to get off not to a good start. Trust me, no manager does, no team do, no player does. You know, we wanted to get off to a better start than, we, than we've got off to, but we haven't. So therefore, we've got to find different ways of operating, five different ways of, of, of producing to go and win performances. And, and, and like I say, you'd always take a lucky one, you don't want to build on it, but you take one.